Go to Edit. Select Points. Ensure there is a minimum of three points in the list to be used to derive the total station position in the unknown points resection routine. These three points can be classed as design points, as shown by the target symbol next to the point name, or a control point, as shown by the blue triangle in the properties column. Once all verified, hit the home button. Go to setup. Select resection. Enter in a name for the resection point. Specify a code if required. Enter in the instrument height of zero. Once completed, hit the next button. On the first resection point screen, hit the known point button. This will then change it to show unknown point. This means the software will use the unknown point for the resection routine. The map and point list icons will be grayed out verifying that a known point is not being used. Lock the instrument onto the prism using the lock icon in the top menu. Enter in a height for the prism pole. Once locked onto the prism or target and getting angle and distance values, hit the green tick measure button. Once the first measurement has been observed to the first unknown point, turn the instrument to the second target or move to the second point for the next observation. Once pointing to or occupying the second unknown point, hit the green tick measure button. Once the second measurement has been observed to the second unknown point, turn the instrument to the third target or move to the third point for the next observation. Once pointing to or occupying the third unknown point, hit the green tick measure button. After the third measurement has been observed to the third unknown point, a match control point screen will appear. This screen indicates that the software was able to identify the raw observations taken to the three unknown points and determine the design or control points they are associated with. If the software is unable to compute the unknown points, a warning message will appear saying, no matching control points were found. A point list and map view will show the user what three matched points were derived from the unknown point observations. Once verified, hit the green tick button. The result screen will show the 3D positional accuracy of the resection occupation point and all of the residuals for each observed unknown point. On this result screen, the user can remeasure any observation if needed, add another unknown point or export the resection report. Once the resection has been verified, hit the accept button to compute the resection occupation point. Once back on the main screen, this concludes the resection by unknown points routine and the user can begin any survey or stake functions.